The Monitor Farm process has been hugely beneficial for both myself uh, and the business um, here at Sockland in terms of enabling us to try new things, experiment a little bit with the livestock enterprises. The challenge for me as part of the Monitor Farm was to move away from reliance and subsidy and uh, expand the livestock enterprises that could then support the, the farm financially. In the last four years we've increased uh, ewe numbers from 950 breeding ewes up to 2,000 breeding ewes. We have increased the cows um, from 40 cows up to 80 currently and we have a, a, a vision of increasing them further, potentially up to 100, 120 cows. We've done this through reducing our arable acreage slightly but also through our use of paddock grazing. The paddock grazing systems developed uh, over the last couple of years to include three and four hectare blocks that we can again subdivide with temporary fencing down to two hectare blocks. We then can run groups of 300 ewes with twin lambs in these blocks for two days and then follow them with uh, maybe 40 cows and calves for a couple of days. Um, so the idea being that we are able to rest our grass for longer, therefore we grow more grass and the challenge is to utilise that grass, producing as much meat from grass as possible. Last year we introduced fodder beet for the wintering of our ewe flock. The fodder beet provides a great source of energy through the winter months that also allows us to rest our grazing uh, platform. Fodder beet works out at between 3 and 4 pence a kilogram of dry matter versus 25 to 30 pence for bottom concentrates. Shows there's a huge saving to be made. We've introduced red clover uh, to benefit soil health but also uh, we see it as a fantastic source of energy and protein without having to rely on bagged nitrogen. Its ability to fix nitrogen is uh, a huge cost saving. So over the last three years we've been able to increase our output from uh, a little under 400 kilograms per hectare to over 700 kilograms of sales per hectare. Something I've really enjoyed about the Monitor Farm process has been linking with Morden and their team of researchers, working on the target selective treatment of lambs for worming and looking at progressive farming techniques and hopefully we'll see this roll out across the wider farming community. The last three years working with the management group and the facilitators as part of our Monitor Farm programme has been hugely enjoyable and beneficial. I think the people have made it. It's been great fun, uh, having the confidence to try some new techniques. Um, it's been hugely rewarding.